Jason contacted me directly and said, I'm going to do something a little bit different. We're going to have a live performance before a movie and we're going to broadcast that live performance to 60 cinemas and the movie starts on the same time. I said, wow, that sounds so ambitious. Why are you calling me? And he said, well, you are the live performance. Dapper's going to host. You're going to headline. And we're going to do stand-up in a cinema. I have no idea what it's going to be like where everyone sat back in those relaxed seats. It could be awful. I've been told not to use the C word, but I may well make one of myself. <laughs> Have you been putting a lot of time and effort into the set for tonight? Have you got uh, stuff in mind? Not really, no. I'm, uh, uh, it's, it's sort of home territory for me, Britishness, uh, violence, culture, that, that sort of thing. I've, I'm, I'm, I'm on home ground, as it were. It's a home guy, yes, let's go mental. You're a fan of kind of hooligan films, the genre? Is it something that you enjoy watching your free time? Yeah, if I'm onto it, it's the type of movie I would watch, whether it's American gangster type thing. Men like me that have no masculinity whatsoever, we like to watch Braveheart, Goodfellas, Football Factory, Sexy Beast. That's what we watch, just so we can feel like men for 90 minutes. And apart from watching films to feel manly, what have you got coming up in 2014? What with the rest of the year, what have you got planned? They've extended the smallness tour. Um, so I'm taking that back up to Edinburgh. I've got about three pilots in the pipeline, but we're waiting to see what happens with BBC Three, and then who knows? I'm trying to grow up a bit and make myself look a bit older, because, you know, BBC Two, got to wear a suit. People who haven't caught the smallest tour yet, what can they expect from that, from the extra day? Girls are going behind me now. Jesus Christ. What? <laughs> For people who haven't caught the smallest tour yet, what can they expect from that? That's obviously been... It's very much an exploration of this aspect of British culture where we're either very introverted, small and posh, or let's go fucking mental, we don't really have an in-between gear. We're very unique like that. Well, I suppose Japanese culture's like it, so I analyse that. And it's very funny, I talk about sex lives and hooliganism, everything in that show. That sounds fantastic. We're going to let you enjoy yourself tonight and best of luck with the set. Thank you very much.